Hey class, next week is a special day. It's called Earth Day. And on Earth Day, we take some time to take care and clean up our planet Earth. So to introduce this, I have a book called We Celebrate Earth Day in Spring. So let's learn a little bit about what Earth Day is and why we celebrate it. So if you look at this book right now, you can see that there's a table of contents. And it says on page five, we're gonna learn about how spring begins. On page seven, we'll learn about Earth Day. On page 11, we'll learn about celebrating Earth Day. And on page 15, we'll learn about how we need to take time for Earth, okay? And so our table of contents is a clue that tells us this is gonna be a list book. It's going to be a book that's full of facts all about the earth and the ways that we can take care of it. All right, you ready? Spring begins. Spring is here. It gets warmer. Plants and trees grow. Earth Day. We have a special day to help our earth. This day is called Earth Day. And over here we have a question. It says, what do you see? What objects go in the recycling bin? So look at this recycling bin that you can see here. What objects are they putting in? I see plastic bottles and a cardboard box. Earth Day is April 22nd. People work together to help our planet. Let's look at this picture and observe it. How are these kids working together to help our planet? I see some trash bags and I see they're all picking up some trash and plastic bottles that were on the ground and putting them in the trash bag. So it looks like they're helping our planet by cleaning up some trash outside. Celebrate. We celebrate Earth Day many ways. One way is to learn about Earth. What are these kids learning about? You can see them with their teacher. She's got a magnifying glass and they're studying flowers. Lee's class learns about keeping Earth clean. People need clean air and water. Animals do too. What do you see? Where is Lee's class learning? Where are they? Are they inside their classroom? Looks to me like they're having class outside. We've done that before. Time for Earth. Coal plants a tree. Trees give off oxygen. We need this to breathe. So we know that oxygen is air, it's a type of gas, and it is what we breathe in. Take a deep breath in. <sighs> You've just breathed in oxygen. And trees and plants help make oxygen and clean the air that we need to breathe. Nora picks up litter. This helps keep our earth clean. Do you guys know what litter is? Let's look at the picture, what's she picking up? She's picking up litter and it looks like litter means trash. It's another word for trash that is left outside on the ground and so she's cleaning it up. Eli's class reuses paper. Reusing makes less, less waste. What do you see? What kind of paper does Eli's class reuse? What is this that they're using here? Newspapers, good job. We reuse a lot of things in our class, don't we? In our maker space, we use boxes, we reuse egg cartons and yarn and sticks and all sorts of things that we find plastic bottles. You guys like to reuse the plastic lids on your applesauce pouches. P 
People like to take time to help our Earth. How do you celebrate Earth Day? The end. So now that we're done this book and we've learned a little bit about Earth Day, stay tuned. We're going to learn more ways that we can take care of Earth and how we can be involved.